Today we're diving into creating an animated bottom navigation bar in Flutter. Navigation bars are at the heart of many apps, and adding smooth transitions can elevate your app's user experience to the next level. Let's start by setting up a new Flutter project. If you don't already have one, create a new Flutter project. Once you have the project, open main.dart and set up the structure. Now create animated bottom nav widget where we'll implement the navigation bar. Let's move on to building the UI. We'll start with the basics and then spice things up with some cool animations. In this widget, we'll need to manage the selected tab and display the corresponding screen. Start by creating stateful widget. Inside, animated bottom nav widget, we're keeping track of the currently selected index, which will help us determine which screen to display and which navigation item to highlight. Next, we have our list of screens. This is where we define the content for each tab. In this case, it's just some simple text for home, search, and profile. But hey, you can put anything here, images, lists, or entire screen. Now let's talk about on item tap function. When a user taps on a navigation item, we simply update selected index with the index of the tapped item. This triggers a rebuild of the widget, updating the screen displayed and the appearance of the navigation bar. All right, let's build that basic bottom navigation bar first. We're using bottom navigation bar widget provided by Flutter. It's pretty straightforward. We tell it the current index, the function to call when an item is tapped, and then we define the list of bottom navigation bar items. Each item has an icon and a label. This gives us a functional bottom navigation bar, but it's static. Now, let's add some animation to make it visually appealing. To make the navigation bar dynamic, we'll replace the basic icons with widgets that animate when selected. Start by updating build bottom navigation bar to use a custom widget. Now for the fun part, the animation, we're replacing bottom navigation bar with our custom container. This container has some basic styling, a white background with a subtle shadow to give it some depth. Inside the container, we use row to arrange our navigation items horizontally. The list.generate method helps us create a list of our navigation items dynamically. Let's break down build nav item function. This is where the animation magic happens. We check if the current index matches the index of the item being built. If it does, we know it's the selected item. Inside, we use animated container widget. This is where the animation magic really shines. We can specify the duration of the animation. In this case, 300 milliseconds. We also define the padding and margin of the container. Importantly, we conditionally change the background color based on whether the item is selected or not. Inside the container, we have a simple row to display the icon and the label. The icon color also changes based on the selection. If the item is selected, we also display the label next to the icon. Run the app, and you'll see your navigation bar transition smoothly as you tap through the tabs. And that's it. We've successfully created an animated bottom navigation bar in Flutter. You can customize this further by changing colors, adding more complex animations, and integrating it with your own app's design. If you found this video helpful, check out other Flutter animation videos on my channel. Until next time, happy coding!